Hello guys, in this video I will talk about the console product and it is application. Let's say we have vector A move 3 unit in the x axis and vector B move in the xy plane let's make it 2 and 3 the console product between A and B is a vector multiplication a and B it will give a vector normal or perpendicular to both A and B so it will be in the Z direction but it, it is now upward because uh, if the angle from A to B angle is anti-clockwise anti-clockwise so it become a ball this is the right hand on but if I make it B into A so B from B to A the angle is clockwise and if the angle is clockwise it will be downward Uh, the application of the dot uh, product of the console product is to find a vector normal to both A and B. Another application is to find the area of the parallelogram made by A and B. So let's make the parallelogram. The, fourth, the first point will be in the origin. I will draw the parallelogram. The origin point okay second point one point choose point and vector from the origin and move in that B direction this is the second point third point equal point choose auto and move in the direction of A and the last point O4 equal point choose O3 and move in the direction of B the direction it will be minus b because the reverse here setting color okay I will make the full parallelogram by this command poly gone list of point list o1 o2 o3 o4 this is the parallelogram made by a and b and i can't find it is area area of a q1 so it is 9 and uh, if I take the length or magnitude of the console product vector if I take the magnitude of vector C the result from the console product uh, oh it is U the, the result from console product let's name it C and length of C is 9 so the magnitude of the console product will be the area of the parallelogram let's do it in octave we have vector A 3 0 0 vector B 
2, 3, 0. Vecteur B, 2, 3, 0. So, the principle act of A and B will give us a vector in the Z direction normal to this vector which is in the XY plane and the norm the magnitude of this vector is the area of the parallelogram normal C small that's it for this lesson